Hi everybody, Dave Sullivan here for Mortgage One with Kevin Elsenheimer, the uh, Executive Director of the Michigan State Housing Development Authority. Kevin, thank you for being here. I wanted to let people know a little bit about MISHTA and what, what is MISHTA, what function do they serve here in Michigan? MISHTA is the state's housing bank, basically. We are part of state government, but we're a little bit different uh, because we can provide loans to individuals and the Constitution says the state of Michigan can't do that. Great. So we have a particular charter that allows us to as I said, act as the state's bank. And we do several different things. Uh, for example, we do multifamily uh, development and lending uh, for uh, low-income housing projects around the state, but we also have a very robust uh, single-family loan program where we'll go out and buy mortgages from banks, credit unions around the state uh, that will have, uh, have clients that uh, will be interested in our, our uh, products. So, okay. So one of the things that you guys do is help homeowners be well, help young families become homeowners, first-time homeowners. What uh, can you explain a little bit about what you guys do in that? That's in an important school? focus for us and our board. Uh, we have a program uh, called uh, Michigan's First Home or My First Home, mifirsthome.org, okay. uh, where we will provide up to seventy-five hundred dollars in down payment assistance for someone seeking that first mortgage, and in some cases even someone seeking to renew a mortgage or refinance. Uh, all the information is on our website, but it's a great program for that young millennial who is uh, maybe graduating college and looking for that first home opportunity. Yeah, people feel like they don't, you know, they can't save up the down payment many times. And when I heard about the program, when you explained it to me before, I was just really impressed by it. It's been a great program. Yeah. Uh, it's something that we you know, we are able to do based on the success of MISHTA over the last 50 years. Uh, it's put, put us in a position of strength so that we can uh, basically afford to give this loan out to people. Uh, it is a loan. The $7,500 does have to be repaid. Okay. But it's not repaid until uh, the end of the mortgage uh, or when you sell the home. Okay. And there's no interest. So I don't know about you, but $7,500 today versus $7,500 in 30 years? Yeah. Interest-free loan, I mean, that's great, especially for people who can't uh, save up the down payment with the student loans that are involved in Absolutely today's right. first-time home buyer. Is it just for first-time home buyers, or is there a limit uh, to how long ago you could have purchased your first house? Yeah, there is, uh, there is some accessibility to the $7,500 for a second home. What I recommend is that people go to our webpage. Sure. We've got a great eligibility tool that we just put on there that's very simple, very quick. Uh, and we'll walk you through the different steps to find out whether or not you're eligible for either the $7,500 down payment assistance for the uh, uh, my first home or my next home. Okay, great. And I'll put a link down below to your website. Uh, but is there any anything else that you wanted to talk about as far as what MISHTA does here in Michigan? I know you develop also large uh, complexes as well. You talked a little bit about that before. We do. We uh, invest uh, using federal tax credits in low-income housing projects all over the state. And the great thing about these projects is they wind up uh, rehabilitating a lot of wonderful old structures. Uh, you and I talked about Muskegon one day, sure. I remember. Uh, we've also done great projects in Grand Rapids, the Klingman Lofts, uh, lots of projects in Detroit, but all over the state, Traverse City, Marquette. Uh, and basically there's a large demand for low-income housing. Uh, people who are working, people who have income, but just can't seem to afford uh, to find places near where they work, particularly in some of the more successful communities around the state. Sure. So we do a lot of that development. And then the last thing I tell you is that we, we take the money that we earn. I told you we're a bank. We take the money that we earn, and rather than distribute it to shareholders, uh, we distribute it to the people of the, state of, Mich of the state of Michigan by helping the homeless problem. So the revenues that we make, the profit that we make, goes to help homeless people in the state of Michigan, which is kind of a neat thing. Is uh, MISHTA unique to Michigan? I mean, obviously, you guys are unique to Michigan, but are there other programs like this in other states? Or Every state in the country has what's called a housing finance authority. Okay. So we're not unique. We were one of the first. Okay. But every state now has a housing finance authority. They're That's not great. all as good as MISHTA. <laughs> That's right. Kevin, thanks so much for being here. It's I appreciate it. You bet.